Early mechanical clocks, handmade, were very expensive. Mostly the people that could buy them were kings and uh, other members of royal families or very affluent uh, members of nobility. They were handmade by skilled craftsmen in small numbers. And since their only customers really were the royalty, they could afford, and were required really, to embellish them in as many ways as possible. We see uh, an early, probably a 17th century clock here from a royal collection. Obviously a lot of gold, a lot of jewels. Perhaps not great timekeeping, but there was uh, uh, the appearance of these clocks was extremely important because they were ornaments as much as they were timekeepers. But they certainly were, were novelties of the time too. There were kings that collected them, that died with hundreds of clocks around them because they were such uh, fascinating things for everybody to, uh, to appreciate and enjoy, and they were novel at the time. But um, I doubt that you'll see too many of these at a yard sale if you start collecting clocks, but you're going to, uh, you're going to see them in museums, and you're going to see replicas of them, and uh, you're going to see the way clocks uh, were before everybody could afford them.